Hi there, welcome to today's investing video. And I read a really interesting article today asking the question of whether Bitcoin is funding ISIS. Now off the top of my head I would find this absolutely laughable and but I'll explain it to you in just a moment. First and foremost, do you have a Bitcoin account? If you do have a Bitcoin account, you may very well find your financial affairs being looked into much more closely by the uh, government of whichever country you're in, especially if that government has got strong ties to either the European Union or the US government, that be that as it may. Because European governments as well as US politicians have reacted to the Paris attacks by an attempted crackdown on all digital currencies and precious, precious metal dealerships, which includes Bitcoin and it also includes prepaid gift cards. And the attempted crackdown and control of all, all of this. Remember that many governments have been unhappy about Bitcoin specifically because Bitcoin helps people bypass government currency controls, which obviously many governments don't like at all. Then, but now as far as the Bitcoin is concerned, just like the infamous weapons of mass destruction, there is absolutely zero evidence indicating that ISIS uses Bitcoin or any other digital currency whatsoever. So where the, the proof comes so that, that there's some other, other causative link is totally beside the point. Then it's long known that the US has had a negative view on Bitcoin for two reasons, as I mentioned. The transactions cannot be tr uh, traced by the regulators. And secondly, traditional finance houses lose out on their valuable commissions. And these finance houses fund political campaigns. So you can see where the crackdown on Bitcoin is effectively coming from. But now, the truth is, that ISIS does not need Bitcoin at all. It generates plenty of income every single day by selling oil to consumers all around the world. And there's also a number of donor organizations that are funding ISIS from various areas around the world. But mainly, oil revenue sales to consumers all around the world. You're putting gasoline in your car, effectively you can say that you are in some way funding it is this by the fact, a simple fact that you put in gasoline in your car. So, Bitcoin is by far not the major problem to be looking at here. That, that's the, looking at the argument as far as Bitcoin funding is this is concerned. And if you have any comments uh, about that, post those in the comment section down below. Remember to click the thumbs up button if you like this type of content. And remember, share this out amongst your friends. And finally, click the subscribe button down there as well. That way you stay subscribed to my channel for all the new content that will coming, be coming out to you daily. And until we meet again, stay safe out there. Cheers.